So I'm still living that hashtag quarantine life. Now, I'm a teacher, so I like to teach my students in a way that they don't even realize that they're learning. Yes, learning can be fun. Sometimes working out can be boring, but we can make it fun. I like working those biceps, you know, working those biceps, working those triceps. I don't have dumbbells in my house. Can't go to the gym. Follow me. We're going to go to my own personal equipment closet. Don't worry about my house and how messy it is. Let's we'll turn the light on here. Let's see. Go in your pantry. See what you've got. If you have canned goods, canned goods, it is not the uh, 50 pounds I'm used to bicep curling. <laughs> Just kidding. The 20 pounds or 15 pounds I'm used to bicep curling, but grab yourself some cans. If you do this a hundred times, I promise you, you are going to be ready for beach season. Tybee Island, watch out. St. Simon's Island, watch out. Hilton Head Island, watch out. You're gonna have the Melissa Makos workout biceps like nobody's business. Do this a hundred times and I'll promise you, you're gonna start to feel the burn. Find something in your pantry. Oh, but what about those triceps? You gotta work front and back. Come on, you got a chair? You got a chair in your house? Make sure that it's secure, okay? This is gonna be a little tight for me. In fact, we'll go at a little bit of an angle. Get on that chair, okay? Scooch out. We've got a couple options here for a chair dip. A chair dip. You wanna make it a little tougher? Stick a leg out. Chair dip. You wanna make it a little tougher? Go out a little bit further, right? Chair dip. Woo! I'm already sweating. If you want more workout tips and you want the full workout, go to melissamakos.com and I'll have the extended version of buys and tries. See you next time.